Hello from Cookbook Divas. My name is Carrie, and it is the first day of March, and it's also the first day of Mardi Gras. So today I thought it would be fun to look through a Louisiana-themed Cajun cookbook, Chasing the Gator, Isaac Toops, and the New Cajun Cooking, by Isaac Toops and Jennifer V. Cole, with a foreword by Emeril Lagasse. We're going to look through this cookbook. I haven't opened it other than to do a reel on Instagram. I haven't cooked anything out of it, and I'm not likely to because I'm a vegetarian, but maybe there's a cornbread recipe that I could try. Anyway, this is not a cookbook review. It's a preview and look through, and happy Mardi Gras, and let's get started. Okay. October 2018 is when it came out. <laughs> I can tell he's a real character. Let's check out table of contents next. It's from Little Brown and Company. Ooh, that's going to be rough for me as a vegetarian, but I'm going to do it for you. I can, I'm going to keep it together and look at some stuff. Okay. Cajun 101 is the first chapter. The Boucherie, the Community Table, the Homestead, the Fish Camp, and the Hunt Camp. And here's the recipes listed at the beginning. That's very helpful. That's nice. Little index. The foreword is by Emeril, and I'll read just a little bit of the introduction. He writes, My name is Isaac Toops, and I am 100% Cajun, born and braised. I come from a land of swamps and cypress trees, of hunting land surrounded by forests and bayous packed with fish. I grew up in Rain, Louisiana, a tiny town of about 8,000 people in Acadia Parish, deep in the heart of Cajun country. My people go back far here, really far. My family members first showed up in the Atchafalaya Basin in the 1700s. We never do anything small, and backyard gatherings of a couple dozen people are just your average Saturday afternoon. Here you'll find boudin, cracklins, and gumbo on so damn good it might make you cry. And if you do, that'll be all right. We truly live to eat. Well, this is going to be fun. I'm going to read the rest of his introduction later. Chasing the Gator. Cajun 101, first chapter. How do you cook Cajun? First, think about what it's like to eat the food. We Cajuns like deep, concentrated flavors. Rarely will you taste a Cajun dish and think, oh, that's light and delicate. The flavor is in your face, always intense, but it's not necessarily going to burn your mouth with spicy chilies. I love to hear that. That's good. He's writing about equipment, ingredients, how to make a roux, including a white roux and a blonde roux. Roux thickens sauces, adds depth to braises, and holds Cajun dishes together. Half the recipes I know begin with make a roux. If you master only one thing in this book, make it roux. Okay. There's a dark roux, a brick roux, a dark caramel colored roux, an instant roux, and homemade stock, crock pot duck and veal stocks. Basics, everyday rice, Creole mustard, Isaac's pepper paste of pain. <laughs> He's talking about wooden spoons. Here's the boucherie. Okay, what's going on here? Boucheries were an essential part of life back in the day when a whole community would lend a hand in slaughtering, butchering, and cooking hogs or sheep. Refrigeration was scarce and you needed all hands on deck. They weren't for hooping and hollering. They were as common as doing the washing on Sunday. Okay. Uh, boudin balls and sausages recipe. Blood boudin. Cracklins. Something called rillons. I've never seen that word before. And that's red wine, not blood, by the way. <laughs> sausages. How to stuff a sausage. So this is a very educational cookbook too. Trotters and white beans. Let's skip ahead a little because I can't show you the whole book. Here's a boucherie ham. Cajun games. This one's called stump. You get a log that's about waist high. Everybody has a hammer and everybody has a nail. I don't want to read the rest of that paragraph. It scares me. Braised lamb neck with braised black eyed peas. I love black eyed peas. Here's the community table. We Cajuns would rather have people over to the house than go out to eat. 
we find any excuse to get together with friends, family, and pe people you think are your family but really aren't, like my Uncle Buddy. This is going to be fun to read. This is Isaac's Crawfish Boil Mixtape down here. And I have been to a crawfish boil, and I basically had to eat corn and hush puppies because I'm vegetarian, but I didn't mind because they were really good. Peel and eat shrimp recipe. Crawfish bisque with stuffed crawfish heads. Here's Cajun Games Liar's Poker. Tata Buil? Mama Toops Tart a la Buil. I don't know how to say that. I've never seen that word. Sorry. The Homestead. Gumbo number one. The Toops Burger. I'll let you look at that for a second. I bet you're drooling. Chicken liver mousse. Confit chicken thighs. Luge canoe roasted bar bone marrow. Roasted vegetables in bacon, sherry, and mayonnaise vinaigrette. So I could make this and just skip the bacon. Lacquered collards. Mmm. Isaac's cornbread. I was hoping there'd be a cornbread recipe. Yay. Now, is there a hush puppy recipe? Oh, squash pickles. That looks good. Pickled jalapenos. Pickled grilled pineapple. Yum. Double dill pickles. Fennel marmalade. Southern comfort peach jam. That sounds incredible. We're in another chapter now. Blue crab camp stew. And the step-by-step -step photos. Cajun queso crab fondue. Wow, this is cool. Stuffed crab. Crab cakes. Raw oysters with step-by-step -step photos. Drunken shrimp. I dated a guy that was a drunken shrimp. I'm sorry. He was a lot shorter than me when he was a drunk. Pickled shrimp. Well, he was pickled. A pickled shrimp, too. The hunt camp. Ducks in the pig pen. Brown sugar and soy glazed roast duck. That is pretty amazing. I made it through it. I hope you enjoyed this cookbook preview. You can see more of them on our Cookbook Divas YouTube channel, our website. We're on Facebook and Instagram where we post co uh, cookbook news and we have a cookbook podcast also if you'd like to listen to cookbook news. That was Chasing the Gator, Isaac Toops, and the New Cajun Cooking. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.